now nerve supply so three nerve you have to remember for this one is sympathetic nerve this is by hypogastric nerve and the root value is l1 l2 okay it supply the bladder the detrusor muscle it supply the trigone and internal sphincter now during sympathetic you don't have to do maturation you are in stress you want to run you don't have time so you don't want to do maturation so sympathetic supply will cause relaxation of the body relaxation of the detrusor muscle so that it should not empty the bladder on the other hand the trigone and internal sphincter will remain contracted are you getting my point so during sympathetic stimulation you don't want to do you don't have time actually it can be done in when you are relaxed when there is a proper timing okay so during sympathetic stimulation your bladder is relaxed and on the other hand internal sphincter and the trigone they are contracted is this clear now parasympathetic stimulation and the sensory both are from the same root value and that is s2 s3 s4 called as pelvic nerve or nervi erigentis you must have read in your anatomy also s2 s3 and s4 and when you relax it is parasympathetic now you want to do the process of maturation so emptying of bladder will be there so how it can happen it can take place by the contraction if it is parasympathetically stimulated it can cause contraction of the body or the detrusor muscle so that urine can pass from the bladder and it will relax the trigone and internal sphincter so this is about the parasympathetic stimulation then the third is somatic okay that is pudendal nerve again the root value is s2 s3 and s4 it supply the prostatic part of the external sphincter and it is under the control of higher center okay it can be reflexively and voluntarily relaxed during the process of maturation this is by pudendal nerve and sensory i have told you it is the same nerve as parasympathetic same root value as parasympathetic that is s2 s3 and s4 and the name is pelvic nerve and this will sense this is a sensory this is a afferent so this will sense the degree of distension of the bladder it will sense the stretch of the urinary bladder when there is urine when urine is collected in the bladder that will be sensed by this sensory nerve called as pelvic nerve and also it can sense pain but by sympathetic nerve okay so sensory can be for distension also and can be for pain sensitive